named. I am Count McFeely. I want to bite your neck. <laughs> I don't know it wasn't him. It's Seamus McFeely. Oh, that's me, Seamus McFeely. And welcome to the 2006 Seamus McFeely Show. Hey, Bones, what do you say about that? Damn it, Jim, I'm a scout and not a sidekick. <laughs> oh, wait, I've got something better. For those of you who don't laugh or don't know when to laugh, because I don't put a laugh truck on here, we have this. So, so, buddy, why did the chicken cross the road? I don't know. Get to the other side. <laughs> hey, you like that? Yeah. Well, he liked it. So we've got, we've got a really, oh, battery fell out. <laughs> got a really great show for you tonight. Um, it, it's sort of, it's a Halloween theme this, this year. Uh, I thought, eh, we have enough Christmas, so uh, we're going to do Halloween. <laughs> All join hands in the middle of the room. Oh, but that's, that's, that's later. And, and for your viewing enjoyment tonight, we have uh, Santa Claus Conquers the Martians. Yeah, ooh, with Pia Zadora, but nobody remembers her. We, we've got some Pez. And, and I dug out the old Arsenio Hall snow globe from his show from many, many years ago. We, we do have our porkies. Always have to have porkies. And uh, our spam. And I think it's about that time. We have a special beer tonight. Uh, old Rasputin. Yes. Uh, I need my glasses for this one. Da, 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 da. Aye, Old Rasputin, Russian Imperial Stout. And he's given a little blessing on there, too. Um, uh, let's just open her up here. Ah, Old Ras Rasputin. <laughs> old Russian Rasputin never tasted so good. Ah, anyway, um, I think that's about it for the introduction tonight. Uh, so let's, uh, uh, yeah, well, let's, let's put on Santa Claus Conquers the Martians, and, and we could sort of do it like, like, uh, Count Floyd in 3D, you know. We were working in our lab. Late one night, when our eyes beheld an eerie sight, for our monsters from their slabs began to rise, and suddenly, to our surprise, they did the mash. They did the monster mash. The monster mash. It was a graveyard smash. They did the mash. It caught on in a flash. They did the mash. He did the monster mash from our laboratory in the castle east. To the master bedroom where the vampires feast The ghouls all came from their humble abode To get a jolt from my electro They did the mash They did the monster mash The monster mash It was a graveyard smash They did the mash It caught on the flash They did the mash They did the monster mash The zombies were having fun The party had the guests included Wolfman, Dracula, and his son. To my Transylvania quiz. It's now the match. It's now the monster match. The monster match. And it's a graveyard smash. It's now the match. It's caught on in a flash. It's now the match. It's now the monster match. Now everything's cool. Drax's a part of the band. And the monster match is the hit of the land. For you, the living, this match was meant to when you get to my 
door, say Elvira sent you. Then you can mash. Then you can monster mash. Monster mash. And do the graveyard smash. Then you can mash. You'll catch on in a flash. Then you can mash. Then you can monster mash. Come on, little monsters. Come on, Mommy Wolfie. We're going to learn a new dance. Come on, Frank. Come on, Frank. We're going to put that macarena to shame. Who cares about that anyway, huh? Boring, boring, boring. Oh, no. We'll do the monster mash. Oh, oh and, and welcome back to the Shame is McFeely 2006 Christmas special. Uh, Halloween, of course, this year. Um, I'm sorry, but uh, we, we had a little problem. Couldn't get Santa Claus Conquers the Martians on the air, but we will be getting it for you there. Uh, so let me see. What shall we... Oh, if you've got one, drink one. Old Rasputin. Now, let's go for my notes. Um... Oh, let's 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 talk about the year 1919. Oh boy, am I off? 2006. Oh, what a year! Oh, and we're having fun right now at Mark and Jane's, December 16th, 2006. <laughs> and if you're watching this, the party must really be going, uh, going. Um, let's say, da -da -da -da. Oh, I, I I wanted to you. Know, well, you probably can't see him in this shot, but we'll cut to him in the ghetto. And another, I want you to meet my friend Bones. Yeah. So, Bones, how's your brother Red doing? <laughs> Get it, Red Skeleton? Ah, okay, here we go. <laughs> ah, can laugh at anything. Sort of like Mark. <laughs> oh, that's his new name. Hello, Mark. How are you? <laughs> oh, no. Let's see. Um. Oh, we've got that. We've got that. Oh, we got. Oh, we, we thought. I th we thought we'd do a Halloween theme this year because we haven't done one, and usually I'm busy doing that uh, David Seabach show on Halloween, so we don't have time to do anything. So we do a Halloween Christmas show. Oh, and you you can hear the Christmas clock in the background there. Ha. So uh, we're, we're going to have porkies this year. I didn't, didn't have them last year because I, I died on them the year before that, but we will have porkies. Um, and the years go by so fast. I mean, it only feels like last week that I did 2005. And, <clears throat> and I really try to forget that. Uh, we did have some passings. Uh, uh, some of my close personal, personal, close personal friends passed away. Uh, uh, Mr. Lou Ross. Lady love, you'll never find. But wiser, it's the king of beer. Oh, uh, yeah. Sandy and I, I went and saw him in concert once. And he, he was... It was very good. That was when he was still alive, though. Uh, Shelley Winters, or Miss Shelley Winters, who was sort of a hot mama in the 40s and 50s. Uh, I never saw it, but somebody did. Uh, Wilson Pickett, uh, yeah. Al Lewis, oh, my favorite grandpa. <laughs> oh, he was one ripping guy. Um, Don Knotts, oh, I hope, Robin, you're wearing your Don Knotts t shirt. You know, I mean, you should, you know. Uh, Dennis Weaver, um, Oh, uh, Darren McGavin, oh, Kolchak, and, and the old man, and Aaron Spelling, and everybody thought he was dead for years, and, and now his daughter and his wife are fighting for his billions and billions and billions of dollars, so uh, when that happens, uh, when I die, there isn't any billions to fight over, so who cares? And if you've got one, drink up. <laughs> 